now that we have loaded our analytical model with the load and we have the supports now we'll come to the second part in which you will export this model to uh, robot structure analysis so first we get the uh, this window which says send model and direct integrations we accept that okay and then it will load the model to robot structure analysis so we'll get some messages here so it's a completed so now the next is that we'll, we'll do the analysis so once we get this structure here we'll do the analysis and we do the analysis by clicking on this icon which says calculations and hopefully we'll get, not get any uh, error separate structure that you want to continue us sometimes when the messages are blue they, they are not very serious so that might be a problem with the concrete not connecting but we are doing a steel analysis so that should be fine so now that this analysis is, is successful we need to go to the design design is that we assigned all of these sections ourselves based on some sort of an estimate uh, now what will design will do is will check this capacity the capacity of these sections and if they are if they are uh, sufficient to carry the load they will be green if not they will show as red so let's go to design click here and there is steel design and there is steel aluminum design so once we get to this point uh, if you click on calculation that will do the design for us this is very quick so here are the sections that we assign to columns and beams they seem to be all green uh, it means uh, they're all satisfactory but satisfactory by how much they might be over designed and to optimize all of these sections it will be in the later stage when we will when we will group the sections and for this uh, this video is will end meaning this is stage number one we managed to model the, the the structure and export it to robot structure analysis and robot structural analysis did analysis and design for us